Hey guys, what's up? We are here in Medford, New Jersey at 7 Do Sports. We're here with the owner, Trey Thomas. This is where all legends are made. All professionals come here. And then, actually, we're so lucky that we have a special guest today. Hank Basket stopped by, and he's also a partner in Athletic Gains out in California. Hank, why don't you tell us about it? It's just been a, a, a blessing to be here. Just so happened to be here when y'all were doing this, that Trey and I were saying it's great when former athletes, former teammates especially, can get together and, you know, build a partnership and move on and, and make gains together, yet give back all the training and all that we've been through. And we were saying, you know, that we have a feeling that there's going to be a great partnership going on here and look forward to working together in the future because we, we share the same uh, ideology on giving back but yet training the best, and it's all about the fundamentals, and that's what, what, what made Trey a, a legend. So uh, I work with a wide range of athletes, and I think that uh, just hooking up with Hank and just uh, getting involved in some of the stuff that he's going to be doing, I'm looking forward to just a great partnership and just keeping expanding what we're doing. Are there maybe a couple of Eagles players that you've worked with a little bit that you know our fans might be kind of excited about? Oh yes, any, uh, any secrets you can tell? Michael Kendricks was with us. We was trained with us for the combine last year, and he came back in the summer this year. Uh, Lashawn McCoy is probably the biggest na uh, biggest Eagle name that you would know that's out there. Did he, he work hard? Oh, he, he worked exceptionally yeah, hard, and uh, it's a great little ties we have. And me being a former Eagle, I feel like I have that tie as well, and that's where. I think that with uh, Trey being on the East Coast and us being on the West Coast, we're going to be able to have all Eagles affiliated with former Eagles. By coastal domination, I love it. Now, I've got one question, one serious question about this bell. <laughs> I mean, you seem to be pretty excited about the defeat bell. I, it's come to my attention that, that Trey's son has actually had to ring this bell and, and gone through the consequences of it. So why do you like this bell? I, I mean, when I hear a bell ring, I know how I feel, but like, what do you, why do you like it? Because just what's etched in up the, um, on the bell, it says, you know, defeat is choice. And I like it is, as a professional athlete, you, uh, we've been pushed to the test. And this, what separates people being able to play at the professional level and, and only at the collegiate level or, or lower than that is who can mentally push their bodies past that. So I love that defeat bell because, one, I'm not doing a workout right now, so I don't have to worry about <laughs> having to go anywhere near that defeat bell. So I feel, I feel bad for you two. Great, but, great. Um, There's a bell in our future. Yes, I have, I have a feeling. Right. I want video okay. footage of that. It's <laughs> going to be okay. Today we are seeing what Susie and I can do. We're going to train here where all the best come to train. We're going to see if we hit that bell. Two, up, three, down, five, flip over on your back, up, one, all wheel, down, two, down, no ring in the bell, come on, go, 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 go